Welcome to Deerfield Beach, Florida and welcome back to my channel. This stretch of beach is about a two mile, two and a half mile stretch right between uh, Boca Raton and Hollywood. Um, this beach is very, I, I, this is one of my favorite beaches because it's, it's quiet, it's laid back, family friendly. Today I wanna um, give you a tour of the beach and we're gonna just um, take a walk along the boardwalk and check out some of the sites on this beach. This is one of the uh, many, many beaches in, in uh, Florida on the East Coast. This is a shot of the Wyndham Hotel we have in the background here. It's right on the beachfront, so it's, I'm not sure of the pricing, but um, I'm sure it's a bit, a bit pricey because it's on the beach. So right now we're going to head south on the Broadwalk and check out some of the scenes on, on this beautiful day. People are just starting to trickle in and the temperature is probably about 91 degrees right now and it, it's definitely going to get hotter. You know we're in that season right now, it's, it's terribly hot. We're hitting triple digits and um, you know that's the nature of the beast so definitely if you're coming here around this time june july august definitely you want to be prepared for the heat drink lots of water let me show you on this side here there's a bunch of um, hotels on this side and there's tons of parking. Right now parking is, it's, it's about 10 o'clock as I said in the morning and parking is not that bad right now. So if you want to get a good parking space, I would, you know, be here early in the morning around 8.30, 9 o'clock where parking is available. One of the things about parking is the, the city of Deerfield Beach patrols this area and uh, make sure parking is enforced. The water is very calm and probably it's about 85, 90 degrees in the water. So, you know, that that is a little too warm for me, but, um, you know, that's just what we get here in the summer. One of the things you want to know too when you're uh, coming to the beach is um, usually around this time, uh, the weather changes very drastically around two or two o'clock, three o'clock in the evening. There's a, this summer weather pattern that comes. Um, so around two o'clock, the, the rain comes down, and um, it's just that's just what happens in, in the summer. You have in the morning, it's pretty calm, nice, sunny, and then in the evening, the the, sh the showers come down. So. Um, when planning a day at the beach, you want to be at least in, get here in the morning and uh, so you can get some good weather. So I'm not sure if these are uh, uh, condos or hotels. Um, but they're right on the beachfront. So we're kind of straying from the actual beach area and walking into the neighborhood around uh, Deerfield Beach. And um, these are 
apartments or condos um, in this this area still on the beach though but it's more inside the, the neighborhood it's nice and quiet around here right now you just hear uh, some birds some parakeets so check out this area here let's see um, looks like it's a bit secluded versus the, the uh, area more north of us that we started off in. Okay, let's move on further south. I got my slippers wet, it's got sand in it. So these look like uh, hotels on this side of the beach here. I'm not sure what's the name of the ho these uh, hotels, but definitely got a nice view of the bay, of the beach. I guess these, they put these here for the turtles. When the turtle come, comes up to nest, um, they uh, barricade the areas. Oh, there's an iguana. I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, I just went into the, the bushes. But there's the tail. Oh, there you go. Ran away into the bushes. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, is make a turn and head back north. Oh, you know what? Let's just walk down here. Looks like there's a, this private beach down here. So yeah, this is uh, oh, it's the Embassy Suites and they have their own private beach area here. back up through here and we can take a walk on, along the, this, the broad walk. So this is a nice nice little area here. Let me give you a shot from the top and this is what it looks like. These are the nice things about these beaches. They have the showers everywhere. Oops. Where you can, you know, rinse your slippers off, get cooled down. Oh, this feels good. Feels really nice. Cool. Okay. Now I'm cooled down two degrees. So yeah, okay. So this is the Embassy Suites uh, Hotel across the street here. They have their own private beach right in front of the hotel. Uh. 
So yeah, Deerfield Beach is definitely one of those laid back areas. Um, if you're looking for a nice laid back uh, area for the family to take a couple days vacation, I would definitely highly recommend uh, Deerfield Beach. Now, if you're on the other side and you prefer the bars and the uh, music, loud music, definitely further down south, South Beach would be one, Fort Lauderdale Beach. I'm actually gonna do a, a vlog on Fort Lauderdale soon, so that will be coming up. Okay, so so now we're on the pier. We just got access. I paid two dollars, and um, I got a wristband for the day, so which is good. I've been out on this pier probably once or twice, a couple years ago. Uh, so uh, looks like it's uh, nice and clean now. It looks like it's redone. I don't want to spend too much time on this pier. I want to show you guys a, another location on the northern, at the end of the, the beach. Okay, let's, yeah, there's some fish in the water down there. So this is a, a little uh, um, cove all the way north of Deerfield Beach. Um, it's, it's pretty much the end of the, the two, two and a half mile stretch of beach. Nice little mangrove area where you can walk through and um, enjoy some shade from the sun. Um, that's one of the things I like about this beach. It's, it's sort of like uh, semi-tropical. That's these nice little mangrove areas that you can walk through. Thank you all for roaming this beach with me today. If you like what you see, please give me a like. And uh, if you want to see more coming your way, just hit the subscribe button. See you next time.